Hey everyone, so what should Christians think about the Black Lives Matter movement? Keep watching this video, the answer may surprise you. So, first off, we need to understand what the Black Lives Matter is all about. Protesters say it is a movement that is meant to stop police brutality against black people for their race. But is it really what these protesters claim it is? That's what I will be answering in this video. So once again, they're trying to stop police brutality. Just look at their solution. They want to defund that they're proposing. They want to defund the police. But does that really seem like a good idea? When I read that, I thought that is the dumbest thing I, they can ever propose. Look guys, so just because 5% of the police department abuse their power, does it really mean that we shall defund the whole police department? Okay, maybe that will stop police brutality, but look here. When a store is robbed, who are you going to call? When someone is following you, who are you going to call? Not the police, because they have no fun. But once I searched deeper into this movement, I realized they were actually aiming for something else. And it is not to stop police brutality, but to stop the police from enforcing the law. Let me tell you how. So if you go to a protester and tell them, why are you involved in this movement? They will answer you with, we want justice for all, or something similar. So now let's take a look at the definition of justice. So it means to have equal rights. But here's what they're really saying. They want to commit crimes without the consequences. They want to rob a store without cops coming after them. They want to physically abuse other people. This is what they want. They are running around saying equal rights, justice for all. But they are really saying, please don't enforce the law. Let me do whatever I want without facing the consequences. That is why they want to defund the police. So that they can do any crime they want without facing the consequences. This is a satanic movement. I tell you stay away from this movement. Do not get involved in this. Not to mention the looting and stealing and all these violence that this movement is causing. But still, even if the protests were peaceful, you are literally wasting your time. You are trusting in men instead of God. This world cannot be fixed. It cannot fix itself. Only God can fix this mess. But the problem is that many people don't trust in him. They will rather trust in the government the president, senators, republicans, democrats, any politician, but the truth is that only God can fix this world, but it won't be fixed because many people don't trust in him. May God bless you and make you prosper in Jesus' name. Amen.